Looking to see if they can take the fight. Flames just with a little bit of a peek in there. Looking to find any information that he can. And he's backing off, but still he's listening. He's hearing them. And they get the opening shot. Dexter to start the semi-final. That's a nice way to get this underway. Oh, Flames on Catwalk. A bit of engagement here. He's going to have to back away, but he sticks around even though he's gushed. Brought down. And Bit going to be moving forward on Catwalk. Looking for one more. It's over and Goose. It's Dexter, the stand-in. Missing some shots, connects with a headshot, but he's got three more to deal with. He's got backup so far away, gets one more. That's a heroic effort, and one more towards railing. Nexo's gonna transition in, and OG in control of the pistol. Yeah, they're doing everything right. Just stay away from Perfecto. Don't give him the chance to get any more headshots. He has to come to them, he has to find the bomb. This is a two versus one that they should win almost every single time. They're giving him a couple of chances here for some shots, but so far, I'm not hitting it. There's one more headshot. Oh, and now it's scary, but there's the return. It's Fiku to take him down, and OG will open up with the pistol. That's a nice start here. On the CT side, OG are ready for it. They already have everyone in position. They know what's coming. This is a good read. Nexa gets the kill on Perfecto, and that should be a bit of a warning to Na'Vi. They've got a lot in this bomb side. A shot comes through onto Electronic. MP9's in that corner. Some die younger with a little bit of a return, but they're so low. They've been denied this B bomb site. Yeah, but Electronics made a great move. He's actually, he was trying to lurk on Catwalk, but not enough kills came out to force that rotation. So he drops out in towards mid where he knows support is going to come up in Neofrag, pushing through the smoke, a huge risk. Back into a 3v3, and Electronic can be the pivot point. He might be the laugh rough right now. He, he can get there. Running, but at some point you're going to have to stop. Oh, and they get a straight headshot from Simple. That's an opening. That's what they needed. Navi, they slowed it down to a crawl, and somehow they're able to come back in the round. Even in a round like that, where kind of a terrible start, they walk into a really well defended B bomb site, but they manage to slow down the game, get a couple of kills, and then they come back for more. Two to one. That's, uh... This is the push right here. This is the push Neofrag's gonna want to have back. Yeah. And that's what I mean, maybe being a little bit too keen, a little bit hopped up because of the energy inside the arena. Ouch. Yeah, as you mentioned, without the Molotovs towards railing, without the nades and flashbangs raining into the sky, this should be relatively straightforward. Electronic with the opening kill over the top of the smoke. OG falling back. That's precise, and he gets another over the top. God oh, damn. filthy. Absolutely filthy. Simple showed up. Every single kill. He's like, I could do it again. Oh, he's... <laughs> he is an absolute artist, isn't he? Yeah, sure. Here we go, long take. Bit gonna lead the way. Flames at the corner with Nexa. Delayed take, delayed turn to the corner. Bit all on his own. A late flash from Navi. Perfecto's got the assist and Bit has control. At least started the walk up behind him, but the entire Navi squad is on the other side. They're ready for this. Oh, a missed shot and a back with a headshot is bit. And that is the kind of punishment. That's the slow play that's choking up OG right here. Perfecto with one on Nexa. And they might want to save the guns here. Two versus five. Pressure going to start mounting for OG. 4-2. As the bomb goes off, Simple goes down, hunting for weapons. Doesn't even matter. Plenty of money on the Navi side to rebuy. They're just... This, they're already gravitating this way. Neo Frank's checking up a dark Nexa. Timing is there, and he almost gets the transfer, but it's a good opening kill. Neo Frank taps away and takes down SDY. Good start to the round. This is it for OG. They need to slow Navi down. We know what happened yesterday, and it can't happen again. So this is their big opportunity. Neo Frank goes down, wants to run through. Maybe a little bit aggressive there, and it's a three on three. Still 40 seconds on the clock. And Dexter, he wants to help out. He wants to save Flames, but he doesn't need it. A big double, and he spins around for the triple a nice round from OG and they needed it badly they saved the double up Neofrag and Dexter both down low off at an off angle Dexter to keep space nice flash to clear it up and they get Neofrag Dexter he's in so much trouble tries to get around the box but what an amazing kill taking down electronic and throws that smoke behind him to try and back on out that's a such an unlikely fight for them to win now when they're both there maybe once he's alone with the AWP, there should be no way out. Simple 
will finally take him down. And if he's back into a three-on-three, -three, how much could Fiku do inside of the bomb side with that AWP? They have a lot of nades, they have a Molotov. If he misses a shot, he's gonna get grenaded out of this round. He gets a lot of damage onto it. Flames is there for the crossfire. Bomb is on the ground with 20 seconds. He's all the way in the back. He's got no way out. Simple will take him down. They call that pause in the game. Even with 15 seconds on the clock, they don't mind slowing it down. Oh, it's so hard to deal with right now, Navi. Yeah, Simple had him pinned into the bomb site. Nexa coming in on the flank, 1v2. Perfecto in the back of the site. Simple up close. They have an idea. There's the utility. Simple missed a close-up shot, but that pulls him into Perfecto. Well played from start to finish for Navi. And still lose the round. So, OG, the pressure is absolutely on. This is not a foregone conclusion. Samda Young taking down Nexa. Not the start they wanted in the defense. Plenty of time on the clock here for Navi, and they're gonna go straight for the bomb plant, and there's no needs to stop them. Oh, no! They try to go for the jump. Neo Frag, he gets instantly punished. Simple is having none of it, and they're gonna back out of the round. His SDY with his kill on the Nexa. Simple as well, another jump comes <laughs> in. That's so quick. Oh, dear. I don't know how long Electronic wants to be here. He's really trying to sell it, but they're out in the middle. Oh, Nexa's aware. There's the jump down. Good read from Nexa. Fiku is up in the window. And inside the bomb side, it's Neil Frag on his own. MP9 to drop the bomb as well. It's a pretty good start to the defense. And now the inside waiting. They're out of grenades as well. No one's coming through up at dark. They're all going to focus on this one, but how do you get through? We'll find out. They're going through the door already right behind. Perfecto comes charging out. And it's a good kill. But a double in return. And now Flames, can he come back for it? AK in hand, oh! And he gets the headshot, and it's a nice clutch. They need it all, wait. Flames knows he has the defuse. Fourth round for OG, <laughs> what a great retake. Oh, I was scared for a moment. Nicely done. That's all you can do in the situation. Hope you get the trades going your way. A good one-on-one -on -one victory for Flames. Perfecto even saw the elbow, caused him to start shooting a little bit earlier than he would have liked if it comes down to it. Gonna be another attempt out middle for Navi and Nexa. I don't know if he could do a lot right here. They've smoked him off, they're already running past. It's gonna be up to that B defense. Oh, big double kill for Neofrag. And Pico, is he ready? Close line, but perfecto, but it's too late. Oh, he gets one more, but there should be no way. Again, deep breath right here. Don't give him any chances. Nexa will close out the round, but it's Neofrag coming up with two big hits on Navi and no bomb plant on top. Oh, and Neofrag again with the aggression. This is one of those rounds where it could really cost you, right? They're up against pistols. If you let go of an M4, it could be an issue. And look, Navi know it as well. They're gonna flash their way through, but he is absolutely ready! A big quad kill! They're mowing them down as they came through. He controlled that angle so well. Towards the B bomb site, AWP in one, M4 in the other. Flames is gonna have to be so quick. They're already here. The battle has already come to the B bomb site. I don't think they can defend this bit with a headshot. Sundar Young to take down Fiku. And it's looking good. Five versus three for the retake in the after plan. I don't think that's gonna happen, but they don't have a choice. They've got to try. You've got to go for it if you're OG. Last round of the first half. Navi looking like they're gonna take an 8-7 lead moving forward. Flames. <laughs> gonna push forward. Nexa falls back to his death, and there goes Flames. It's all on the last one. That's it. Navi gonna take an 8-7 lead. It's halftime on Dust 2, the first map of these semifinals. We'll be right back. They're gonna be here quick with a big force. Yeah, and Perfecto's got one flashbang. They wanna clear out Nexa first. They wanna use that flashbang to turn the corner into the bomb site. They need to take care of this. Oh, no kills for Nexa. That's unfortunate, but here it comes. Oh, they're out there. They all have Glocks, so a little bit of a range advantage. Perfecto, one more headshot. Oh, no! Navi, they're back with a vengeance! Oh, headshots for the retake! That is so well done. They made that look easy. 9-7. Navi extend the lead again to two. I mean... Look at the read he, from Navi. Yeah, he has this peak a hundred times over, though. All he needs to do is pick his head up over the box. Yeah, oh, there's the chance. Took a minute, but he's going to be able to get it. And Navi, they're already in position. They're already lean this way. They have SDY down on Catwalk, so they can be here lightning fast. Electronic trying to buy a little bit of time. Simple being a distraction up in the window. Going to get the kill. Jumps up, and now it's Dexter. Low on health. He's got the double, and he's got 25 seconds, and he reads it. He sees it coming. He wants to take the fight. Oh, tagged in the leg instead, and SDY takes him down. Navi... Catwalk is probably where it's gonna be. Electronic is tired of waiting now, but that might be a mistake. Shot by Dexter in the back. 
Yeah, there's no time for this. 15 seconds. You're just going to have to jump right through the smoke. This would be a disaster if they can't die before the time. Simple. Yeah. Going to pick off one. Yeah, I think they're going to be just fine, although they're, they're really slow playing it at this point. Okay, plant's going down. Now Navi have to be aggressive. That's a good tap from Nexa to ensure that they'll get the bonus money. They need the bomb plant first, of course, otherwise you can't do much down there from long. And there's the Molotov you were talking about at 16 seconds. That is devastating. They're going to have to wait it out a little bit. Nice headshot. That does change the calculus a lot. Six seconds on the clock, and they're going to scope that one up. Dexter able to take down Electronic, and Navi maybe slipping up for one of the first times in this series. That's a three-on-four victory where Navi knew what was coming. A hard round to win. Molotovs. Yeah, it's a smart move. Back to SDY at the mid doors, looking for the drop down, looking for the jump up over the top. Oh, the FAMAS gets one, but you're not escaping that. You're not going to be able to win against the second one. But Simple slides back into position, oh. and there he cleans up Nexa again. He was running. How did he get the scope up in time? They wanted to go quick, I think, to that B bomb side. I think Nexa had the right read, but now they've been slowed down, and Peter's listening. He knows. Can he get the shot with the FAMAS? It's an instant blowout headshot, and this is looking real good for Navi here. Two versus three. What do you do afterwards? They got that catwalk control. They have a, a Molotov on Dexter. And there's no smoke on the Navi side. Hold on. This could get a little bit interesting. Oh, they're going to use it already. And they already passed. So that Molotov doesn't really help them at all. Flames fighting at every angle, but it's too much. Simple and bit to fight their way back into the round. A double kill on each. Never really kind of making a decision, just getting picked apart every step in the way as you're trying to gain control. Simple with that kill. He had another one in the round, but constantly harassed by a player in this position that FAMAS just recycled. And OG could never get a grip on the round. They're going to try and come through. Yep, they send Neofrag in first. He is just completely unafraid, even though he knows Simple's on the other side. He gets one of the kills, pre-firing it and almost taking him down. That was the right idea. Flash comes through. Simple, there's a lot of rifles on the other side. Too many for him to handle. And Nexa will take the kill on him and down at long. I don't know about this SDY. He tries and he almost gets the double, but again, a lot of people on the other side. He lands the headshot on Nexa. This should be their round. Oh, sort of almost another. already won it. Yep, they get another kill, and at least the flank is in. Two versus two. There's still a way to get back. But SDY, they haven't been able to get rid of him out on long. Fiku, he can't get the fight, and now there's no way home here. Dexter with seven seconds. Time is running out. He tries to go for the fight, but no matter what, it's done. Some die young with an amazing hold. Quad kill out from long. They sent everyone to fight him and he took them all down. What an incredible performance. He never had anything to worry about from behind. He's just standing tall, taking the fights. Both his teammates done. Great entrances provided by OG, but some Da Young bring back a three versus five. What a spectacular round. He's, he's been the playmaker. He's been actually just so aggressive. Yeah, but you got no utility to make this long entrance actually work. Some Da Young, oh, he was turning for the flashbang. They don't got one. Easy double kill for him at the off angle. Add a third. Could be back-to-back -back quad kill rounds, and indeed it will be. Some die young putting on a show here in Lisbon. To the Navi side, you can see down in lower dark pit. Is he going to be ready for it? He will be. Takes one, continues the spray, and he's good for, for a double. It's not bad. He's not finding anyone on the bomb side. Navi are happy to play this as a retake. They don't care if you put the bomb down. They just want to win the round. Dexter, he hits the ground. Simple coming out now. An electronic flanking them from long already before the bomb is even really planted. Now they're stuck inside of the bomb site. There's nowhere they can go. Oh, no. They made that A bomb site their grave in the end. Electronic will take down Nexa, and it's going to be 15 to 9. It's such a... I mean, they knew everything, Navi. They had full control of that round. Ooh, a little edge in that smoke might have caught Simple off guard, but he was ready. Well, they're going to give him a run at least out long. Straight through with a flashbang, trying to see if they get the swing. and they have the timing? Oh, they're coming at Simple, and he's ready. Oh, no. Going to kill as well from SDY. I like the bravery. They wanted to take the fight to them. They got a little bit more than they asked for. Fika will take down Simple at the end, but two versus four right here. Unfortunate. Wasn't pre-aiming it. Wasn't ready for that one. Looking for a fight up close instead. And Fiku won his own, trying to battle at every angle. Some great headshots, but he is out of health. And it's going to be a 16 to 9 win on the opening map of the semifinals. Navi, they're one step closer to setting foot in that grand final. Awesome to see OG able to test Navi in the first half. But once we sit switch sides.
It's going to be Navi starting on the CT side with OG on the T side. And once again, every single thing OG can get here, it all counts simple though. He'll start off. Second map with a headshot to take down Nexa. It's a good beginning here. He's ready for more. No, oh, no! He's going to take two more with him. And that's a lot to handle. Electronic here with the duelies, though. That's a wild jump shot to make a, a little bit back in the round. Could get a bomb plant. They probably will. In a two on three, maybe, Jason. There's a way out. Dexter, how much does he have in him? He's going to have to get that headshot immediately. And eventually, Perfecto swings in for the fight instead, and Fico's all on his own. One versus three. They're coming at him from every angle, and Bit eventually will find his head. Firepower nonetheless. Pretty aggressive in the middle. Flashes in. They definitely hurt the steps, but caught with a nade in hand. That's a rare sight. Simple. Not ready for flames. Is Sunda Young going to be already put to the test? Oh, they're just powering onto the bomb side. No way to hold this for Electronic. Even if he got one more kill, more players were going to stream in behind him. And Neofrag, he really was the king of aggression on Dust 2, and he is ready for more. Taking down Bit Perfecto, wants to take the fight to him, but it's definitely not going to be a winnable round here. Nice return for OG in the second round. That's what we like to see. Yeah, just what a great tactic out of spawn. Obviously, had some kind of a read, some kind of an idea, and just marching up middle, not even caring that there's a flash peak from Simple, just continuing the pressure. Yesterday, they, and they kept playing with three people on that side a lot. This time, they're a little bit quicker to get Electronic back to Arch just in time for Nexa to show up with the AK-47. And Simple, he wants to rotate in, but he gets caught as well. Oh, they're all getting caught down in the pit. There is nothing that he could do. SDY, that is not going to be a winnable fight any day of the week. So, wow, nicely done. They caught this particular round for OG to go Archway. That's a very... 2022 meta kind of, kind of round. If they really think that he's going to stick around. Oh, wait, it's going to be quick. Flash to set it up. Comes popping out of the holes, jumping right down the court. Mid air, simple, able to hit the shot. And SD Wild will follow it up. I like this idea. They thought that was going to be a heavy banana stack, but they may still be able to do something. Dexter and Neofrag, two versus three. Close now with the AWP. He finds one. Can't even get the Deagle out in time. Good refrag from Perfecto, and Neil Frag is on his own, and he is caught jumping up on that railing as well. Navi. Let's see. Oh, they're falling back. They're faking it out. This is the right call, but again, they run into simple over on this side like they did in the last round, and it's a little bit worse. He's got that AWP primed inside of the bomb site. 15 seconds. OG. This has to be nearly flawless. Simple. He's got that angle covered, and Electronic is here as well. No problem for this defense. Dexter. Nothing that he had to do to get into the site. Navi answering back now. OG couldn't have known it on the minimap. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Back to the A bomb site. Simple's just picking him off. And SDY is so comfortable in that position. First time out called from OG's offense. It is close, and look at it. It looks like they want to change the pace again. This could be another really fast hit. Simple, nearly caught with the nade in hand. Oh, the two for one! Taking down Flames and Neofrag, but it doesn't change the facts on the ground. SDY is still alone in the pit, and he has to get a kill. He has to stay alive here. Electronic is now getting a bit... This closer. is the bomb. Yeah, OG, they're slowing it down purposefully. They want to see if they can find some more, and they kind of did. But as you said, the bomb, Electronic able to swipe it out on Arch, and now the problem is they have to go fight for it. A little bit of an issue right now. Electronic can't be stopped in the library. Dexter one versus three, and Bit is at a weird off angle. No way to peak that one. 17 seconds on the clock, Perfecto and Bit, the only ones that can stop this right now. It's a lot of damage on the flames to begin with, Perfecto. Oh, he gets swiped by Neofrag, that's the kill they need, but Bit, he's still fighting inside of the bomb site, and time is running out. They have to go for the bomb plant. Simple! Oh, it's so close, nearly the headshot. But the bomb does go down. And now Electronic and SDY, they walk into that AWP. Dexter, he's got the health, and he certainly has the skill for it. Electronic trying to fight his way back into the round. He gets the headshot on Nexa. And that sets it up for an absolute heartbreak here on the OG side. He's got a kit. Can he get that kill on Dexter? Making noise, and no Dexter! He's going to be way too quick. A nice triple. And it's OG with a much-needed round. Especially with the nades that they have, that pit position should be almost neutralized. neutralized. Nexus, he's got the Molotov. All he needs to do is land it in that corner, and they're not going to be able to defend it. They're ready as well. Ooh. Oh, no. That's one hell of a headshot for Bit. That's a little bit of an issue. Smokes up defensively to try and slow it down yet again. They know they need some backup out here. Electronic, he's done a lot of damage already. SDY with a kill on Neofrag. 
And this is trouble for OG. They had it set up. They had the right idea and the right read. And now they're getting the kills to follow it up. Dexter is there to catch it and Flames with a headshot and they complete the round anyway. That looked like it was about to fall apart. That was crazy. The smoke being down made it so difficult for Piku to get involved, but what a good opening kill. He had another one of those kinds of headshots back on Dust2 that netted OG around. He's got another one here against Simple both times with the AWP. And the AK is just ringing out. Good work from OG. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. No mistakes could have been here. OG, one simple screw up, and they're not going to be able to win this round. Ten seconds now on the board. They're running in all the way in the corner. Electronic, is he going to be ready for it? He's there. He can... Oh, but he walks in to a flashbang, and that's the end of him. Perfecto. Now can't stop the bomb any longer, obviously. Three versus four. The timing could not have been worse. Hard to explain what we're seeing here. But it's something special, without a doubt. Dexter well aware. I'm gonna find Perfecto, and he's ready. If anyone else wants to take the fight, he's gonna try. But at least the nades are looking pretty decent right now for Na'Vi. Oh, Electronic, he's on a mission, running down the middle. And they're gonna find Fiku, no problem. With the smoke up there, how much does he want to play around it? This could be a little bit too much aggression. Nexus on the other side, but he still wins the fight. Well done, Na'Vi swinging for the fences in this last round, and it's working. Easily get... One shot fall back down below. Perfecto, first point of challenge. <laughs> He's just covered enough. Oh, they're wasting a lot of time here. He's hard to find, and he gets Dexter as well. Oh, it's heartbreaking. But there is a chance. It's doable. 25 seconds. Neofrag has no idea where anyone is, though. This is going to have to be just an incredible reaction shot. And if he waits, if he waits too long, there's going to be no time to play with the bomb plant. Simple misses opportunity. Oh, he's got a chance, and he, there it is. There's the headshot. Plant's coming in hot. Neofrag on for the clutch. If there's anyone on the team that you'd want alive in a round that requires nothing but pure reaction and aim, it's pretty much Neofrag at this point in time. He's been good with it, but Bit, there's a huge gap in that one. Oh, we almost had it! But Bit saves the round just on the edge of the smoke, and it'll end 10 to 5. Yeah, just looking to cut off any kind of a quick flank that would be coming down banana. Nobody's even close by, but there are four defenders here. Turn in the corner, Neofrag over arches. There's a nice setup. Nexus got the first, but all oh, both responses go to Na'Vi. Now they can split the B-bomb site. Fiku and Flames looking like they're lost, like they got nothing to do. Not looking anymore, though. The timing is off by just a second. Simple, if he keeps running here, you've got to be in trouble. He's not hearing it. He's no idea. Oh, the timing is nearly there. Dexter, though, he's still alive inside of the bomb site. Symbols back fraction. <laughs> oh, he took that as a sign of disrespect, and now he's on his own, Dexter. And there's no way out. Simple, he's going to make sure they absolutely win this round. You got to kill Simple when you have a chance. That's brutal. What an incredible pair of shots from Simple. There's no way you're getting into that bomb site. Navi win the pistol. Second pistol of the map. Look at this shot. So quick, <laughs> so accurate. This one as well. Answer to that question is zero, because all five of them are over towards Banana. A Neofrag out on an island. Activated by a pop flash, gonna come back for it. Simple's caught jumping. Oh, but he wants way more. A second kill, but Nexus still all alone. That's a huge smoke to put down. They're gonna come right through it, or are they? They want it too. They try maybe a little bit late. And Nexa, he's good for one. Flames tries to follow it up, but it is too late. SDY will take him down. Oh, that is. That's right on the edge of a knife that round. SDY, Molotov out. But he's going to be able to escape. And he did get the bomb plant on top. They want to go for this one. This could be a pivotal round right here. Perfecto, he's got the right aim. And he looks for it. Sprays down Fico, no problem. And Dexter, wait a minute. Through the smoke. I don't think even he was expecting it. I don't think he knew that was going to happen. Does he have time for it is the big question here. He knows where Perfecto is, maybe. No kid. On. No, but there's one on the ground, I think, right in front. Yep, he's picked it up and he's running it. Oh, oh no. He's, he's not even going to go for it. He just fakes it out and Perfecto runs in for the headshot. Oh, he had to get it. It's a quad kill on Perfecto. And it saves Na'Vi. Oh, that could have been devastating. Just not having the tools that you really need. And this is where, oh, Fiku had a chance. Scooshed back, some die young, electronic, simple, all combining for the opening kills. There goes Dexter. A bomb site open for business. And for the moment, Navi's just piling on. Yeah, they're not lacking in confidence once again. Simple out hunting. Easy couple of kills at the end for him. 30 seconds. It's not a bad setup if they can actually complete it. 
Electronic goes down in the middle. It's a pretty good start now. 25 seconds. This might be one of the better rounds here for OG. All they need to do is get some of these early kills, and now they've done it. Slowing down. Now be on top, and there's no way to get into this bomb site here. Bit and SDY. Nothing to do in this round. Gonna try and fight it out, do a little bit more damage, but it's gonna be finally a round on the board in the second half for OG. Simple again leading the charge up banana this time with a much quicker pace. Behind the car already. What a dangerous position this is, and Neofrag never expected. Nexa's got a fight in the flanks. Oh, what a double kill. Put up the smoke, Molotov on top. Electronic, he can't see anything. Jumping up on the barrel and still getting the headshot on Nexa. They would love to pick up the pace right now and keep challenging Flames at the B site, but they don't have the bomb. It wouldn't have mattered if they cracked into things. Is he gonna give him one? Here's all this information. Yeah, he knows. That's a free kill. And that surely has them boxed in. The health that he has and the time that's left, it should not be doable. Fiku's not peeking. Okay, right at the last second. If he'd gotten around that corner, it could have been something interesting. Not a lot of great utility for Navi to make this work either. Just two flashbangs on electronic. Fiku trying to get aggressive. One of the information, again, more than he bargained for. He goes down, and now Neofrag and Flames have to tuck down. I don't know if they can defend this one. Dexter is not even anywhere nearby. It's gonna have to be a two versus four defense and it starts out amazingly getting the shot and nearly electronic on top. They know where Neofrag is and he sprays them all down. That absolutely was beautiful. Triple in the round for him. It, uh, even that it's going to a third map to me is definitely a little bit shocking. We're not there yet, but everything points to it. Oh dear, oh, Dexter gets pulled out. Trying to do a little too much. Neofrag is going to be here to close the gap, though, pretty quickly. They're not ready for him. They're not ready for that, and the bomb drops inside of Library. Neofrag again under pressure. He falls next. 50 seconds still. If they find Nexa, it's a disaster. Tech 9 is there, and SDY almost gone in that first volley. Nexa, uh, yeah, just stay alive. That is the only thing you have to do right now, but it's not easy. They're out hunting him no. and Electronic with the AWP. Able to bring him down, oh dear. What a great call from Electronic as well. He knows Nexa's the only defender here. He knows they can attack the one player instead of going back to the eight bomb site. Three kills in the round. Navi might just save the day here. This would be an unbearable heartbreak. If they win this round, Navi, that might be all it takes to spark them right back into the game. Kits are there, but the Electronic finding the shot on Fiku and Flames. I don't think there's any worth it here. They're not done yet. And OG's economy cannot handle this. It's not built for this. Rounds already down, and we'll see if they can continue. A little bit of a lineup there, but the smoke is something that blocks them off. Flames, though, he said good for one at least. Do they realize, do they have a read now on how many people are here? They're still sticking to it. This, this is all summed by Young. If he can come out the holes, that's a great kill from Simple. One's hiding in the smoke. Right around the edge, it's Fiku. It's Fiku with two. Nice double. Oh, with a deagle. It's not enough, and Nexa will go down. Now, how much can we expect out of the Frag here? He's got 17 kills here. Yeah, they're going to fake it out. They want to make sure that he's not going to come charging through. Running all the way through middle. Picking up a smoke in transit. I don't know if there's a kit. Oh, there is one behind him. I don't know if anyone's even calling that out. He's going to go for the fight. Right there with the AWP, and it's SDY to take him down. Now he, they live through. Pretty common setup right here. Perfecto burning, and he's flashed. He can't see anything. And by the time that flash goes away, he's no more. They're giving up on that passive defense. They're going to go and check if Navi are there. This could cost them everything. If Flames goes down, this is not the same defense, but instead, he turns it around with a huge double. And Electronic is on his own. There's nothing he could do right now. Everyone is going to be showing up, and this is looking good. OG about to hit 15. Oh, no. He's going to get a... Ooh, he doesn't peek all the way. Yeah, but look at that A defense. Oh, no, they're walking away. They think it's a hit. Yep, they walk right into it. 18 seconds, and Dexter, they're all coming for him. And even with the double kill, it's not enough. That one spot in CT spawn, and the call comes out from OG. One more opportunity for OG. Great play, great calls from Navi and Electronic. Infiltrating CT spawn. But again, being allowed to dictate everything on this T side. Yep, they're inside of the fortress, but there's not going to be any kind of backup coming. 
little bit of a flash. Oh, what a Molotov. That's going to segment the whole thing. Neo Frag with a shot, but he goes down. 18 seconds, but the bomb is stuck behind that grenade still. It's all on Nexter, and he's going to be found. Perfecto. Not tricked by that one. 10 seconds. And a three on three in the octagon. Two kits and look at the nade and look at the HP on Perfecto. If they can find that position towards triple. And they're coming in from Banana. They're not going to waste too much time. Might all be on that one nade. Is he going to let go of it anytime soon? SDY up here by the barrels. And there's that nuclear bomb to take down Perfecto. SDY fighting back. He wants that overtime and he's back around the corner. They can go straight for the defuse. SDY one versus two. He swings, but it is not enough. They spin it around and the defuse is in. Oh, gee. They weather the storm and we get to see a third map. That is excellent from OG. What a great first half. Dooley's on Perfecto, but Simple gonna do his trademark challenge on Mirage P250. He wants it early. Looking for information, looking where he can take that fight. Quickly down mid, Electronic and Perfecto already turned the corner. Oh, he actually came back for the kill. Fiku goes down, but he did beat Simple in that challenge like you were talking about. So a three on three now. Nexa stumbling a little bit. A little bit of a hiccup right now, and that could cost him almost everything. How do you know when to recommit to this fight? Some noise being made. Nexa, he might almost get caught. He's running right past, and Bid is so worried about his health. It's SDY to find the headshot, and that is a huge gift to Navi right now. Neofrag and Nexa. No health, obviously, on one of them, and Bit, he's found the timing just fine. Even no oh kill, my Lord. it's just going to draw them back. The fact that they live is probably enough. SDY with the shot, and Nexa, there's not much he could do right here. He's going to go down. Bit finishing what he started in the middle. They're pretty aggressive down the middle. Looks like it's going to be some speed behind this one. Potentially only one defender right now. Oh, they need to get here quick. He's in so much trouble, Nexa. He's trying to stay alive and back out. He knows what's coming. Mac 10 jumping around the corner. It's a good stop, but he has to do way more than that. He needs at least one more kill here. And it's a good start. Oh, wall bang shot through the bench wall. Flames with one on pit as well. But now comes the return. Simple and electronic. That is a deadly duo. And they've just got a couple of kills back. And electronic, yeah, <laughs> sees the smoke. He knows. He can sense it. And he swings for the fight. Takes down Neofrag. You could only make one tiny mistake like that. Oh, he missed the <laughs> jumping shot. Electronic, how is he still living? Thanks to Wonking, close now. Trying to take up a position. Electronic, I don't think he even knows that he's that far up. And Dexter will find him out and hunting. And the first round is on the board for OG. I mean, still, that's, uh, I think, at one point, very briefly, a 2v5 for Electronic and Simple. They bring it all the way back to a 1v1. Try to make sure you can end this round before you need to go for any kind of a retake. Ooh, nice timing on Dexter. He is lightning fast, even against Simple. They need Bit to open this up with a kill. They need to, to pull someone away. It's pulling flames back at the moment, but Bit has such low HP. How are you possibly going to do it? There's one kill off him towards Palace, traded off, but you know Dexter's close, and he's got another kill, and OG's got another round. And they're all here. They're in connected. They're ready to set it up. This is going to be a pretty difficult bomb site to hold right now for OG. Piku, though. Maybe he's in position for it. Oh, he gets checked. Electronic. That's an important look right there. Otherwise, it might have been a different round. Look at the health that's left on Flames after that. Neo Frank comes in with one, but immediate return. SDY is sneaking through jungle, able to pick him off. And Nexer is on his own. One versus three. And Bomb's being planted. He wants to go for the challenge. He doesn't get any look at anybody. And now it looks like he might have second-guessed himself just a bit. That's an odd hit. That's a really tough hit to read from OG. Just Navi walking their way into position, walking their way into an opening kill. Electronic already jumping up in towards window. Nobody would even spot it. Nobody know it's coming. Neofrag's going to be a free kill. If Navi just wait, Electronic is going to crack open this bomb site. It's just, oh no, he goes down. Flames is able to find out long range. That's the SMG. That's unbelievable. Bit still here. Taking a little bit over back again, but yeah, I can't believe he's still alive. <laughs> How's that happening? Fiku with the headshot. Oh, wait a minute, that's the bomb. Yeah, oh, he wanted that, but the bomb actually did get lost on the wrong side of that smoke. That could have been a real nightmare for Navi, but now they've stabilized it just a bit. Nexus still has to hit that shot when the time comes. He's delaying it a bit. Oh, a lot of damage onto Pit. What a find from Fiku. That is brilliant. That's the player that was at Ticket Booth, though. If, if Navi realizes it, SCY can get a plant safe because it's not safe at all from Nexus Flank, and that's an easy kill. Biding his time and patience is rewarded. Perfecto goes down. OG tie it right back up. 
They needed it. They needed something. Not going to be able to find the follow-up. Fiku doesn't have any information. Oh, his attention is split. He's somehow going to get away. Still alive, but he burns. He burns even though the smoke was there. And Navi on the back of Simples Deagle with three kills have cracked in at a fourth. Because why not? He kept the pressure on. He, he actually read this. He's not even this kill, but he's so sure after that AK spraying up at him. He's so sure that he can keep the pressure on. <laughs> it's ridiculous, isn't it? He's 13 and 6. Look at him in the middle, trying to control this entire part of the map. And that means they have a pretty good defense over at this A-bomb side, at least in terms of manpower. Obviously, with the pistols, it's going to get a bit tough. But they do have that 1M4 trying to get into play. Bit will take down Neofrag, and Dexter is now far away from the action. What is happening? Oh, no! Flames! Flames. And wait a minute, Nexa gets one more kill and the spray is in, he takes down SDY. What is going on? It's bit to hit the ground next, and somehow they steal the round back. Flames heard the footstep, he heard the landing, he knew what play was being set up, he knew someone was in the smoke biding his time, but that's unreal. Two quick stabs, Electronic goes down, and then Nexa turns it on its head afterwards. Beautiful double kill, simple and SDY. And it's Navi's turn for a timeout. Oh, this might get real tricky. If Neo Frank goes down, Nexa is on an island, and the backup is miles away. Good kill. Oh, and he catches him mid-air. It's Electronic to break it up, and Simple is back with it again. That duo is doing so much work for Navi. It's keeping them heavily in this first half at the moment. Three versus three, and look at Bit. A little bit of a flank coming in on the other side. You can see Fiku, Fiku is trying for it, but they're in trouble. Bit step by step closer to winning this round. He finds Dexter, no response, and that's a quick round. Seven to seven, all tied up. That was all Bit. He, his. And we just mentioned him. I mean, he's just played this position throughout this half so, so well, Bit. He's had a great game thus far on Mirage. Eagle, not a lot to work with. Dexter is there. He's going to be able to take care of one of them. Eventually gets smoked off. The backup is here pretty quickly. See what they could do. One more round makes all the difference right now. Neo Frank gonna pick up one of them, and that Molotov doesn't spread far enough into the corner. It's gonna be Fiku with the headshot instead, and they just keep trading into the round. And they're gonna back out. They have so much time, Navi. And Dexter's in an aggressive position you probably would not expect. Yeah, I don't think they're reading this. They do pull out the rifles in time, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, oh no! No way! What's going on? Simple with the headshot on Dexter, clotheslines him. And now it's up to Fiku, and you better believe he's under a lot of pressure right here. 28 seconds, simple. I don't think he realizes. Oh, he's going to go check anyway down the middle. Back inside of the smoke, he fakes it once, and Fiku finds him anyway. Eight rounds on the board. Oh, gee. They finished the first half with a lead, and that is well done. At 14 kills, Electronic at 13, and Perfecto's going to get a deep angle. Got to be careful. In transition, jumps out the window. They're all coming this way, but there's three defenders on point. Yeah, a lot of USPs here to try and slow them down. I don't know. This is not going to be easy, and they're even being slowed down themselves, kind of having a hard time getting out. Now there's even more players at the B-bomb side. Electronic and Bit. Oh, but they're fighting back. No way. Nice swing for Electronic. <laughs> he just wipes him out. And Fiku on his own. And they, I mean, I think maybe five seconds earlier, they would have had at least just a five versus three fight, but they got slowed just enough down. Now, the bomb is committed to the bomb site, so he can't even pull any kind of weird tricks here. And Navi are not giving him anything. No mistakes being made right here. He has to commit to this fight if he wants it. And they're ready for it. Bit will take him down. Nice early pistol round here for Navi. That sets it up well. They're playing for round number three in the second half. Yeah, makes sense. Oh, yikes. Yikes. Wow. Poor timing. Poor timing. Electronics rotated over. He's got to pick up the pieces, and he's going to do just that. Oh, it's clinical. Thank God for Electronic. Yeah, I think you're dead on right. It's about that attention. Just try to pull it a little bit away. SDY, he still swings for the kill. It's so good. He's ready for it. He was in a very bad position right then and there. Simple. A little bit of struggle, but he does take down Flames, and here's a bit of a return, but I might be too late. Electronic in a one-on-one -on -one versus Nexa, and no bomb plant happening yet, so Nexa has to run for it. 15 on the clock, and Electronic, he's got the health, he's got the timing and the audio, and he wins that one-on-one -on -one easy. It's another triple, another multi-kill for Electronic. Oh, gee, this is... This is some of the runway is going to be gone if they can't win this one here. Frag, all right. Takes it and goes aggressive, and Electronic is not ready for it. 
huge double. Wow. Due to the headshot on, on some Dai Young, there, he had never had the intel that Neofrag actually dropped into the site. The death cam came in too quick. Oh, bit. He's going to respond. Three on three. This round is not done yet. Simple is in for a big flank. Bit and Perfecto just need to survive because Simple is going to be so impactful the closer he gets. This is so lightning fast. There's absolutely no way that you're going to know about this. Although Bit going down is a little bit uh, unfortunate. Bomb being planted and Simple thinks it's inside of the smoke, but it's not. It reveals his position. He still gets the headshot, but he did give up a little bit of info early on there. Two versus two and Flames, he's nowhere to stand. Oh, he's in such an uncomfortable position. Nearly already getting spammed down, but they take care of Simple. Perfecto tries to make the jump, but Flames will take him down and OG a must-win round. Man, give Neofrag all the credit in the world. Two banging headshots to crack open this bomb site. This is disgusting. First tap on Sum Dai Young. Electronic never saw the reposition into the bomb site. Never saw him drop down. Disgusting. See if it's going to end up working out in their favor or not. But it's really not a lot to work with. Dexter, <laughs> what? All right. He almost opened up the bomb site just like that. What? <laughs> what a wild play to make. In the final half of a semi-final, a lot of flames on his feet. Fiko is going to get one of the kills, but SDY is trying to stay alive. Grenades being thrown at him, and somehow he's still here, and he nearly gets the kill on flames. That is actually an impressive round nonetheless. And two versus three here. Next, they're going to be finding the kill on Electronic, and stepping into the bomb side on the other side with the bomb is flames. He's got the position for it, not the health. It's the one in the worst position. He's trying to figure out how he can possibly help Perfecto. Good to keep him off the plant, but now tuck yourself into a corner. Bit in jungle, trying to get activated. Flames might be exposed, and... Ooh, Bit hasn't peaked just yet. There's the angle. He's arrived at the perfect moment, and it's all on Nexa. Let's see if they know if they could figure it out. They don't have a kit, but that's not the problem right now. Ooh, they get that close line. Nice shot from Bit. He puts himself into the round once again. A triple. He took no damage. No one could touch him. They took a lot of damage in this one, and there was a bomb plant as well, but... I can't believe how long Sum Dai Young stayed alive. Yeah. Molotov at him, nade at him. He's over at the A-Ramp this time, while the rest of his team trying to take some mid-control. Neofrag making the same run without the AWP, but he wins the fight. Simple's right there for the return. But this is some good info to work with if you're on the OG side. That's actually so important that Simple gets the trade. Oh, Dexter missed on a jumping player. Spam oh. through, lands the shot. Tough kill to take for SDY. He's still at a pretty big disadvantage right here. Walking into the site. What a wrench in the works it would be. Fiku, he's using that trigger control. Oh, spins around. Can he get it? Yes, he can. That is scary. Simple. No, Back but it, with the it, revenge. it's ruined all the plans of OG. Yep. Everyone was shifting across the map. Now Simple can actually get an angle on towards Catwalk. They've got no smoke. They've just got one Molotov on Dexter, but he's so far away. It's going to be all up to Bit to try and save this round. And with the time that's left, he still could. 14 seconds. He goes for the fight. And this is a nightmare for OG. They're in a lot of trouble right here. They smoke it off. Bit still hiding on the other side. And Simple's shown up. No oh, time. no. They're no out time. of time. They cannot win it. Oh, disaster strikes for OG. And now V, look at the fans, they go crazy. 13 to 9. Oh, that was so close. OG just did not have the resources at the end of the day. They had nothing to get them up safely. And once again, it's Nexa with the clock running down who just doesn't have any other option but to run and make noise. That allows Simple to know what's coming and get into position. Especially because Electronic is like, cool, I'll take that Miss Smoke. Yep, wants to swing for it, and he gets the fight as well, and Flames, you can't even really... Oh, you can, I guess. You shouldn't be able to fight back, but he lands the kill anyway. A simple missed shot, but he can definitely try to get that wall bang. There's one and the follow-up, and he finishes it off. Still a two versus three. Bit's going to be able to take down Nexa, and the bomb is only freshly planted. It's a long time to wait right now for OG while the rest of Na'Vi get here. Perfecto looking... Making sure they're both in the jungle right here. It's a good headshot, and Neofrag, they know where he is. He's locked in. They have a Molotov as well, and the bomb is already being defused. Not much he could do. 14 rounds on the board for Na'Vi. I'll tell you what, Bit played that great first half. It was more of a cerebral first half lurking in the underpass on the T side. But this CT side, he's been wonderful as well. The fragging, the impact, the rounds that he's had to win for Na'Vi have been incredible. He shot up the scoreboard now with 20 frags. They don't have any more needs to really throw around with. They haven't not even got the bomb plant yet. This is 
No longer an A-bomb site. It's a graveyard for OG. Nice lineup. A two-for-one shot. And the bomb is on the ground. They're such in control of this one here. A little bit of a mistake, maybe. Simple walking into the shot there, but look at Electronic. He's ready to close this out. Get to series point. It's a double. He crosses that 30 bomb. An amazing game from Electronic right now. And Navi, they're one round away from the grand final. I don't know what they were so afraid of to get that bomb planted. They were paused. They had everything they wanted. They had utility in the choke points. They had as safe as a plan as you were probably going to get in that scenario. They bought whatever they could on the OG side, no doubt. Mac 10 on Nexa already taking a bit of damage. It's Electronic, 32 kills, still in regulation. He's relentless and he's back for more action. He's gonna get the headshot. Oh, he turns it into a triple. He gonna reload right now. The bomb is committed. An absolute god in this semi-final. Electronic with a quad kill to end it for OG. And now we have made the grand finals here in Lisbon. Unbelievable. What a show from Na'Vi. Electronic, the brand new in-game leader.